This is part two of our father-son <laughs> Bailey Mercado project. Um, and thanks to Bailey Bristol, we have copies of the original brochure. Now, we found out it's from 1967, and thanks to Wikipedia, we now know that... Uh, the, have you ever heard of the Beatles? What about, have you heard of uh, All Did You Need Is Love? Yeah. yeah. Have you heard of the song All You Need Is Love? No. Okay, well that was released. Right, What's this is the price list. Yeah, which, and which one's it? Outline. We have a... Ooh, I felt it again. <laughs> yeah, the bed base is a bit soft. Right, we have the... The Bailey Mikado... Okay, can I this Hang on, hang on, we've got, we'll tell you what we've got first. The Bailey Mikado T, which means, what does T stand for? Toilet. Toilet, yeah, we have a toilet. The Mercado S, medium extra sized Torah with extra space. S for space, T for toilet. This is big already. Imagine how much bigger it would be if it was an S. You don't really need a bit more space than this. Look, I can't even. Look. Yeah. Don't need much more space. I, I think we could play Twister there anyway. Yeah, that's got a lot of space. Imagine how big that would be. I know, it'd be mad. Right, can you remember how much did we pay for this? 400. 400 pounds, right. So we have the Mercado 12 foot That's Mark ours. T model. How 369, you paid more. Oh, I suppose <laughs> no. they're rare. Yeah, they're, they're very rare, Sorry. yeah. So yeah, in 1967, this was 369 pounds. And what does that word say there? Stop press. One of the reasons we know it's 1967 is because this has a slide out at the back which makes it a four stroke five berth model. So we have the options list and what it comes with. So there's ours. Mercado 12 foot Mark T. So number of berths? Four. Four. Number of berths four. And it comes with toilets. Length overall 14 foot nine. Six foot six wide. Eight foot high and it weighs 1200 weight. Independent suspension. Telescope jockey wheel. Telescopic. Telescopic jockey wheel. Jockey wheel. Uh, <laughs> get my words muddled there. Corner, corner parking jacks. Well done. That one. Metal tow bar cover. We have central cooking cabinet with hot plate and griller. Oh no, did she have that frying pan in here? Yeah, that's still in there. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Uh, the toilet compartment or larder, so uh, the choice is yours. Toilet or somewhere to keep your food. Luxury pile carpet and two gas lights. Right, so stage two of our project is, can you remember what it is, Charlie? Take them out. Yep. Take that out. Yep. Take out the roof panelling out. Okay, right, can you remember why Take we're doing all that? Because that's damp. Yeah. That's got. We're see, um, seeing if that's. We need to replace stuff under it, okay. behind it, and get oh, rid of that. Look how mouldy that is under there. Don't touch that. You touch it. <laughs> I'm not touching it. Uh, so, what we're going to do is access the frame. Um, and the, the aluminium frame. Well, there's, there's wooden battens under this bit, between this and the aluminium outside. Why? Well, that's what holds it all together. You know the toilet. Area. That, that's bowed. Yeah, we'll replace that. You know the toilet? Yes. Well, you can see the wooden frame in there that's rotten. Can we? Yeah. So we will then replace all the wooden frame that Charlie's inspecting now. Um, yeah. And once the wooden frame's done, we can then put the panelling back on, or new panelling. Smells in there. Does it? Yeah. <laughs> Sit back on your so once everything's stripped out, we can repair the panelling and then put everything back in here together. That's a wrap up. We'll see you in part three. No wonder the snail died in here. <laughs> Why is that? It smells horrible. <laughs>